Hello and welcome to Soft Expert. Today in this video I'm going to show you how to create a business listing website using WordPress and Elementor just by drag and drop and the website where people can register as seller, they can list their services, their businesses, restaurant, hotels, events and so on. You can do it easily by watching this video. And this is a multi-purpose theme where you can list places, restaurants, hotels, events or you can target a specific one. Like you can only list a barbershop and you can list the barbershop near you or anywhere in the world and this is the website that we will be creating in this video i'll give you an overview of the theme that how the theme look what is the theme functionality and how you can get this theme and then how you can set up this theme with demo content and then for the list of customization like to make changes to the pages using elementor and to add payments to add listing to your website you can follow the rest of my videos and before creating the website let me give you a quick overview of the website that we will be creating in this video and you can also get this demo by following this link and this is the website that we will be creating in this video as you can see in the top we have this header with the logo then we have a powerful search bar let me show you if i click this you can see it loads all the items with the categories a few items and this filter now if i search something like this this is ajx search as you can see it loads the item that contains a and all the categories also now if i search for something else like then this will show me the items that have t in it and also the places the categories where this text is found so this is a powerful search bar where you can get result by just typing text let's close this then on the right side we have our main menu where you can list the pages that you want you can have multiple pages, you can change these links and so on. Then we have login and register, so I'll show you later in this video. Then again we have this search bar, and this is also AJX search bar, like if I search for something like event, this will load the listings that have events. And this is for listing, this is for restaurant, as you can see the search bar is changing, and this theme also have a built-in search bar form, where you can design your own search bar form. This is also changed, as you can see we now have this date, and then we have this one then we have this title and description and these are basically categories where we have listings events rent house and restaurants then we have these listings so we can open any of these we can learn more about these this is basically hotel food and drinks and so on this is also a slider then we have some top listing for the places so if i click this this will open up these places which are under barcelona then again we have some listing these are for shopping, hotels, and destinations, and so on. Then we have top listing this week, where you can also display some properties, some of your business listings. Then again this place. And then we have this one, Explore UK. You can change the title, you can change the listings, you can change this filter, and so on. Then these are some famous places, like places categories. And here you can list some of your top authors, like the people who are listing on your website and how you can earn money with this theme is you can have fair listing so people will have to pay you for listing their jobs their businesses you can also charge extra for promoting a list to the home page or to a sidebar and so on you can also display this section for downloading your app then these are some events and a footer so as you can see this is a complete solution for your business website for your business listing website i'll show you how the login and register work and how a business owner can see their dashboard their events their listing later after we set up this theme so let's see how we can get this theme and then how we can set up this theme and then how we can customize this theme and for creating any type of websites that is either a personal website a business website e-commerce websites you will need to have a domain name and hosting and basically domain name is your website name People will land on your page on your website after typing the URL. And hosting in simple words is an online storage where your website files will be stored, where you can manage SSL certificate, your domains, your emails, your databases, PHP versions, and everything related to your website will be managed in the control panel in the hosting. You can also contact your hosting provider for any issue on your website or you can fix your issues right in the cPanel. And there are multiple platforms available that will provide you domain and hosting. The one I would suggest is Hostinger and if you follow this link in the description, you will get a discount on hosting. You will also get a free domain with hosting. Let me show you. So if you go to this link in the description and scroll down, you will see the plans here. 
So this is for single website as you can see single world face, world face starter and so on. And these are the pricing you can see very normal and very affordable. If you scroll down you will learn more about these plans. So here you can host one website you will get this amount of storage, this amount of bandwidth. This one doesn't include a free domain and have weekly backups and so on. And with all these three plans you will also get a free domain. Unlimited SSL which is this lock icon. This make your website trustworthy and secure. And you can get this amount of RAM, this amount of cores of CPU and so on. Please don't get confused here. Just select any of these plans based on your budget and based on your website visitor and storage. And normally this plan will work for you as you can see this is most popular one. So just add this to cart. And this will take you to cart page where you can see the overview of the plan that we have selected. And then you can scroll down and you can choose a favorite. So if you want to get this for 1 month, 12 months, 24 and so on. So the more time you choose here the more discount you will get. Now the normal price here is 432 but if you scroll down with the discount you will get this hosting with 143 USD and this is for 4 years. So just create an account here or login with Facebook or Google. Then pay for this hosting and you will get this hosting for 4 years with a free domain for 1 year. So once you pay for this then this will take you to its dashboard. Let me show you. And this is how your dashboard will look. And you will see the hosting plan that you have selected with your domain name. And you can also create free domain emails using this plan. So this is how you can get a domain name and hosting. And now let me show you how you can install WordPress on your hosting. So to install WordPress, just go to your dashboard like this and then click on manage in front of your hosting. So let's click on this. And before installing WordPress, let me visit the domain just to show you. You can see there is nothing and we are set to go. Which means that our domain is ready, we just need to install WordPress on this. So let's go back. And to install WordPress, you can scroll down. Go to websites and you will see WordPress. Just click on that and if you don't see WordPress, you can go to auto installer and you will find WordPress. So let's click on WordPress. And the first option is to detect WordPress. So if you are not sure that this domain has WordPress or not, you can detect your WordPress by clicking here. So this is brand new domain and we don't have any WordPress installation here. So I'll just click on install WordPress. And here we can type our website title, our email, username and password and we'll select our domain. That's it. So let me quickly fill this. And here make sure to choose HTTPS and don't write anything here. We want our website directly on our domain and then we'll click next. And then you can select the WordPress version. So the most recent one is recommended. You can choose your website language, disk space and PHP version are fine. And you can select update only minor version and then click install. And that's it. Now this will install WordPress on this domain and I'll show you. And now you can notice the dashboard is different and if you scroll down you will see more options and you will also see WordPress version installed here. And now let's check our domain. So if I refresh this we got a 2023 theme with hello world post. You can find this theme and the post in the WordPress dashboard and to access the WordPress dashboard you can go back and here you can click on edit website and this will take you to WordPress dashboard. And this is the WordPress dashboard where we can install themes, we can install plugins and we can start creating the website. And now if I visit this website, we have nothing here, we just have this post. So let's see how we can get this theme and how we can get all this data and then how we can customize this. So to get this theme you can again go to this link in the description which will take you to this page. Here you can see the theme name is Will City Directing Listing WordPress Theme and have more than 400 reviews, 5k comments and so on. You can learn more about this theme here in this page. And you can see this. You can see the listing, the events, search bar and so on. And now to get this theme, you can see the pricing here. And you can just add this to cart. Now this is one time price. You don't have to pay this annually. This is one time fee. And you will get this theme for a lifetime. And this theme also comes up with some premium plugins for which we don't have to pay. We just need to pay this amount only. So just add this to cart, then go to checkout and then scroll down and here you can pay with Visa, Mastercard, Paypal or Squirrel. I will put my details and will click on pay securely. You can see payment complete and email confirmation is coming your way. Now to get this theme you can scroll down and here you will find the theme that you just get. 
and you can download it from here or you can go to your profile and you can go to downloads and then here you can download the theme so just click on this and download all face installable files only and this will start downloading the theme you just need to extract this and then you can upload this to your office by the way you can also get its license and purchase code so just click on this to download its purchase code and this is our purchase code and this is our theme let's wait for this and after downloading the theme you will get a file like this now we just need to upload this to our office so let's go to our office dashboard and here we can go to appearance themes i have this theme only so i'll click add new upload theme we'll choose file and we'll select that file open and install now and then go ahead and activate the theme and just like other freemium themes you will get this notice about installing plugins so just click on begin installing plugins and here you can select all then scroll down and make sure to uncheck this this one and also this one and these are the plugins that are related to WP Bakery and this is the plugin that we are not going to use we are using Elementor and then here choose install and apply and sometime you will get this error but you can again go to install plugins and then you can also try installing one by one like this and once you install all plugins then select all choose activate and apply and now we have activated all the plugins let's go back to our dashboard this will open up Elementor but we can set up this later so let's go to our dashboard and now we have the theme and all the required plugins but still if I refresh my website we still have nothing we just have this blog post so let's see how we can get all these content so for that you can go to your dashboard and then you can scroll down and here you will find Velocity import just click on that then scroll down and here you can choose the page builder so make sure to choose elementor and select home page so you can choose home page modern or static so we are using home page modern that i just showed you and this is to import home page only or if you want to import everything you can click on this i need everything so i'll click on this one and this will start importing so let's wait for this and import process completed let's scroll down you can see we imported all these now if i visit the website so let's just refresh this you can see we got the logo the search bar and here we can create the menu add listing button the main categories and here we can add listing and also here and these are the places categories some more listing here and so on so this is how you can get this theme and how you can set up the demo content and as i said i will not be covering everything in this video but let me quickly go through the theme options so let's go to our dashboard and now you will see this VLOOK tools so these are the tools that are using for the listing for the events and for the promotions and so on here you can find the actual listings so if i visit this you can see we have all these listings with these categories with these tags and this is the date and so on if you want to make changes to these you can edit any of these you can add your own by adding new and you can also go to listing locations to change the location listing categories and listing tags and these are the categories if you want to edit any of these you can edit these you can add new by typing here and then clicking add new here so there are lots of options to explore in this theme but uh, i can't cover everything in this video i'm just giving you a rough idea that how you can manage this theme and to make changes to the actual pages you can go to pages and here you can find the main pages that you can add to your menu you can edit these with elementor and then you can do customization just by drag and drop and uh, these are some warnings that i'll fix later and to learn more about this theme you can visit its documentation you can visit the link in the description and you can learn more about this theme and uh, to check the dashboard you can go here and you can see this is the dashboard profile reviews and messages and so on so a business owner can manage all of these things right in the front end they don't have to visit the admin dashboard let's go to the dashboard and this is the dashboard that a business owner will see as you can see this has published this much listing these are under reviews unpaid expired and they can manage their profile their business name their first name last name and so on 
and they can see the reviews and they can communicate with the built-in messaging system here they can see the notifications here and so on so as you can see there is no notification if I go to messages I can type a username and can message them and here I can type a message and so on so this is a front-end dashboard that a business owner will see and where they can manage their businesses their listings and so on to add a new listing they can click on add listing and then they can choose to add a listing to add an event to add a restaurant or to add a house and you can also add your custom listing to this let's choose this one for now and here you can see first i need to set up my pricing so for that i can go to commerce product and i can create packages so this was how you can create a business listing website using wordface and using will city theme and if you want to learn more about wordface elementor and woocommerce you can visit my channel i have lots of videos about them and still if you have any questions you can ask in the comment section thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next